A little love in your heart. Yeah. It's more than you know. So amidst all the things that are going on in the world, I'm growing watermelon and it's starting to sprout. Two are actually starting to sprout and I'm actually happy. That alongside tomatoes and we're growing cantaloupe. And the cantaloupe, it sprouted as a plant, but not as the fruit. Uh, tomatoes, they have sprouted. I've had like one of the tomatoes that sprouted, very sour if you ask me, but um, they sprouted and I have like the baby tomatoes that are starting to sprout as well. Although the last couple of days here have been cloudy, but today before I did my aerobic uh, dancing workout today, um, I just noticed because I was just checking outside if it was raining or whatever, and I saw the watermelon and I was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. It's crazy because you know what? We entered Virgo season, all these tomatoes, the watermelon, they just started coming out of nowhere. Because in Leo season, I couldn't get one tomato to just, what's the word? I couldn't get one tomato to sprout or at least more than one tomato. Like we had one big tomato and then I planted um, the seeds that were inside one of them. And then I kind of planted like half on one side of the planter and half on the other side and they started growing but then these bugs came and started eating the leaves and they just start they're, now they're just stems virgo season came about and she was just like hi and all of a sudden tomatoes are sprouting the watermelons are watermeloning the cantaloupes she's getting there she's taking her time she must be a taurus i'm just like it's so crazy it's just so crazy i've just felt that I needed to share that amidst the world. Because now you have dogs laughing at other dogs' negativity and cats cheating on each other. crazy well but amidst everything i actually cried a few days ago because i sat in i wouldn't call i mean it's nature technically but i sat outside and it wasn't like so hot it was right before the sun came up and i was looking at two cicadas just you know messing around in the tree i don't think they were doing the do but they were just you know buzzing around and i just i really just realized because in that moment things just started clicking like they haven't clicked before. I now can understand why people are like, oh, you know, you have to go outside in nature. I, I'm not talking to trees. I don't, I do talk to my plants. I do sing to my plants when I water them because I do believe that, you know, singing does help them to grow because when I wasn't singing, I wasn't getting tomatoes. I started singing to my plants and all these tomatoes start came out of, I, I'm just saying, I don't, mind having conversations with trees and nature because you will be surprised on the messages that you get. Personally, I don't talk to trees. You know, I talk to my plants because I, I purposely, I care for them. And for the trees, I feel as though that it's like, well, the trees are being taken care of by the universe in general. I could talk to them, but usually I have my conversations with the universe indoors. I cried the other day because, and I guess it was just like a huge releasing. And I just, I felt like a weight has been lifted off of my heart. And ever since then, I've just felt childlike inside. But I've also been, as much as I try to tell myself I'm going to rest, and like I have been resting, but like... When I tell myself I'm going to rest, I'm going to take a break, that's when I get all these ideas. So I'm just going to tell myself that I'm going to rest and take a break more often and see what other ideas come. But that's really been my life recently. And I'm, I'm like, I, I, that. it's been my life recently and I like where my life is heading. You know, I don't know what's coming next, but I'm also happy to not know. Like, I'm kind of excited because I feel like something is coming and I've been saying it for like, I don't know how long now, but um, I'm excited to see what's coming, but I'm not attaching myself to it. But that's it. I felt like sharing some great news um, about the watermelon and my plants. So go on back to your day. Goodbye.